The greatest asset of working in confined spaces and containers is where the worker is unsure or unaware of the required procedures and doesn't know exactly what to do in a given situation. The people who enter the area must have been trained. They must have been given work instructions and have undergone full preparation. Confined spaces and containers are often not identified as such, or their danger is underestimated. This is why several hundred workers die every year around the world. A large number of these deaths are preventable. There are typical characteristics for such containers. One of these is a lack of oxygen. Another is the lack of natural ventilation. Too little oxygen in the air can have dramatic consequences. At around 14% and above, physical and mental abilities are reduced dramatically. This can be seen through a lack of orientation or slurred speech. A lack of oxygen is the number one cause of death when working in confined spaces and containers. The danger of this type of work is that the individuals entering the location bring their own hazardous substance with them. In other words, I exhale CO2, which starts to build up at floor level. And I also use up all the oxygen in the container. This is why ventilation is so important. There may also be pipes or ducts leading to the container. After all, the container was put there for a purpose. I must ensure that these ducts are blocked off or even removed. It could be that a valve is not closed and the container rapidly fills up. Toxic gases could start to form, for example hydrogen sulfide, which can be fatal within a very short period of time if the concentration is high enough. This can be the case with the wastewater or chemical industry. It all depends on what I'm working with. I may also encounter problems with chlorine. Chlorine gases are just as dangerous. Another aspect is the risk of falling a great distance. How do I proceed? How do I get down there without falling from the ladder? For example, I have to be winched down. This is only suitable for people who are properly trained.